Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make a cool car particles transition effect with no plugins easy in After Effects, let's begin. First of all create a new adjustment layer. Cut the ending of an adjustment layer and match it your first clip's length. Now apply a CC ball action effect. Let's change grid spacing to zero. Change displace property to saturation. Then make sure you are at the beginning of an adjustment layer and click on display stopwatch icon. Scroll to the end of that layer and bump up displace until you are happy with it. Now scroll back to the beginning and apply twirl effect. Click on angle stopwatch icon and then scroll to the end. Change angle to negative 40. In case 40 is not enough, you can change it to whatever you wish. And once you are happy with it, press U on a keyboard to expand keyframes and then select all of them and press F9 on a keyboard to easy ease them. Then go to graph editor, right click here and select edit speed graph and then make a smooth curve. Now scroll to the middle of an adjustment layer and press T on a keyboard, click on opacity stopwatch icon and change it to 0%, then go to very end of that layer and change opacity back to 100%. Let's quickly check the effect. First part is ready and now we have to make the same with the second clip, but with a different values. Create another new adjustment layer. Move it above your second clip and then cut the beginning to match the second clip's length. Now apply CC ball action effect. Change grid spacing to zero and then change displace property to saturation. Now make sure you are at the beginning of a second adjustment layer and then click on display stopwatch icon. Bump it up until it's cool to you. Once you are satisfied with it, scroll to the end of an adjustment layer and change displace back to zero. Now scroll to the beginning and apply twirl effect. Click on angle stopwatch icon and then change it to positive 40 or to the value you have set on your first adjustment layer. In my case on a first adjustment layer twirl was negative 40 and a second one it should be positive 40. Now go to the end and change angle to 0 degrees. Now press U and then select all keyframes and press F9 on a keyboard to easy ease them, then go to graph editor and make a smooth curve. Scroll to the beginning again and press T on a keyboard, then click on opacity stopwatch icon and then scroll to the middle of a layer and change opacity to 0%. Let's quickly check the transition. And here we are done, but for a better results I will add a shake for my pack. I will skip shakes part because I have made too much shake tutorials, also I have made 16 unique shake presets that you can get from the link in description, check how it looks like with my shake presets. With a shake it looks way better. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.